My name is Matt Bergen. I'm the head of the hardware engineering team here at Altium. Uh, my team is based out of Altium's corporate headquarters in Shanghai and liaises with Altium's larger development organization, which is spread throughout the world, including China, Australia, the US, Europe, the Ukraine, a whole variety of different places. As an engineering team, we were asked to describe how we use Altium Designer and what are some of the reasons for some of the choices that we've made. So we thought that it was appropriate to set customers off on the right track and really help get them using the software in the right way out of the gate. Really what we wanted to do was develop this collection of modular pieces that anybody in the organization can reach into, pull out, and have 100% confidence in the quality and manufacturability of that element in their design. That includes everything from the board level components and the board level implementation of something, all the way down through to a collection of drivers and services, everything that's required on the software side of things to implement that thing. Bolt driven electronics design is a label that we apply to a methodology, but you have to be careful not to hang a wall on the hook. Altium's Vault technology is certainly a key component in this methodology, but the methodology is much bigger than simply the vault. You know, at its core, vault-driven electronics design attacks head-on so many of the long-standing issues that plague engineering managers and engineering organizations. Namely, how do I leverage talent across an organization? How do I ensure that each and every piece of design data is designed with an eye for reusability? How do I eliminate the duplication of effort? How do I do away with the data duplication and the inconsistencies that are inherent in that? It means that we isolate our risks and we can spend more time being creative engineers, more time drawing from a pool of existing IP and designing cool and interesting things. At a management level, of course, this allows me then to leverage the talent in the organization more effectively. So everyone from the specialist with specialist expertise all the way down to the new grad who's working on their first few designs out of school. They can all begin to build up modules and contribute to that pool and then every engineer in the organization has access to that information. Altium's a unique company because not only do we develop electronics design software, but we also develop electronic products. And this has really forced us to develop and then implement our own methodology or our own approach to electronics design and really test that in the real world. Being in China has really opened our eyes to what's possible. It's clear that this is truly where we need to be if we want to help our customers and really ourselves as an organization navigate that next big shift, which is already well and truly underway. This is where the growth is coming from. And this is where that next big pool of talent is going to emerge. We really had to retool and rethink just how we leverage the opportunities that are available here and what impact that might have in other regions. You know, truly, if you can do business here and you can be successful in doing that, you can do business anywhere in the world.